Hello Camigos! I am here to do my Goodwill haul, finally. So I went to the Goodwill here in Sunnyvale to look for pants that I can practice on because I think in my last haul I said that I got a new old sewing machine and I'm trying to figure out how to let out waistbands and stuff like that. But I went there for that. They weren't really having any sales. Uh, I always thought that Goodwill's always had like certain tags that were 50% off, but for the life of me, I went on the website, I couldn't find anything. I looked around, I actually did a couple rounds in the store because usually they have signs that say, hey, like blue tags are 50% off, blah, blah, blah. Anyway, I digress. I couldn't find anything as far as like additional sales. So pretty much I guess everything I got here was full price. So uh, let's go ahead and get into this Goodwill haul. Alrighty guys, so this is a just plain ivory shirt and it's by Mainline. This is a size small v-neck as you can see and it's very free-flowing. I love it. It's 100% organic cotton. I actually got this for $2.49. So this is a shirt by only, I don't know what the size is, but I'm guessing it is a small or a medium, but it is blue and white striped all the way across. And the neckline is an oval. I don't necessarily like t-shirts that go all the way up here. I just feel too trapped. I need either like a v-neck or something like this would be where I would go as far as like how far I would want a shirt to go. Um, it's super loose at the bottom so it's not form-fitting i actually wore this with jean shorts the other day it's actually pretty comfortable so yeah so i got this for two dollars and 49 cents Alrighty, guys so this is a white tank top and it doesn't have a brand but it's a medium if you guys look up close i don't know if you guys can tell but there's like it's a little bit has a little bit of silver flex dust in there so a little bit of an accent and the back is actually a tee. I like it because it's like something I can wear here in California, especially. It's really free flowing. Bottom part is just like that. So my usual, I can do this, the usual. So this I got for $2.49. This is a regular crew neck, crew neck sweater, crew neck t-shirt. And this is by Universal Threads and it is in a size small. It's almost like a heathered maroon color. Uh, again, with the rounded neckline, very free flowing, not so tight. I think as I get older, I like my clothes to be a little bit looser so I can just like relax, you know? But yeah, just a regular crew neck t-shirt. So this was going for $2.49. This is another white tank top and this is by E&M and this is a large, so it's a little bit bigger, but I really like, again, the openness here and it has a three straps on both sides. The back, there you go. And what I was thinking with this is I can wear it like this, you know, pair it with some jean shorts or something. So this I got for $3.69. I have the gray tank top here with the American flag draped on it. No size, no brand name, so I'm not sure. I actually got this because I wanted to wear it when I was running. It's actually, this is like the types of shirts that I wear when I run. Yeah, it's gray, so you'll see my sweat, but I don't care. Um, pretty basic, yeah. Racer back. So this was going for $2.79. This shirt is a little bit unconventional for what I usually buy. This is by Twick and it's size extra small. Um, it gave me like mid-century vibes, you know, like I know, bear with me. So I'm planning to wear high waist jeans with like a tan belt, some white sneakers. That'd be cute, right? It's mustard yellow, a little bit of a light pink, maroon, dark maroon, stripes going down, cuff sleeves. Uh, a little bit different, but I'm excited to actually style this. This is actually going for $2.49. Alrighty, so let's see here. I actually have my receipt. Yay! So I have a total of seven items for $19. Pretty good, huh? Not as good as my, my hauls back in the day, but you know, I'm trying to get to know my thrifting surroundings because it's all different here in the Bay, especially where I live in Sunnyvale compared to my last haul in Modesto. That's the Central Valley. I live in the South Bay. It's a difference in pricing for sure. Alrighty. Well, I hope you guys liked this video. If you guys did, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more videos by me, click that red subscribe button. It would totally make my day and I will see you guys later. Bye.
Yeah, yeah.